How's it going YouTube? This is the Hummy Fitness, the Hummy 47 on YouTube. Got the big Hummy Joe Roman right here. Um, just it's been a while since I made a video. I know it's been probably a month now. Um, I was finishing up my first year of college and uh, hitting the gym just randomly it wasn't on a for sure set schedule for my workouts. And then this last week I. I got really sick with a bad cold, ear infection, so I'm feeling a lot better now. Um, the last, it's been like one day and eight days since I've hit the gym. And so today I'm gonna go in, hit nothing too crazy or not a big body part. I'm gonna hit probably some shoulders, some traps, and maybe some quads because I'm gonna go meet up with my buddy Chris. He's gonna hit uh, traps and quads. So um, I'm gonna start getting a, a, a workout video going on for you guys and this summer is gonna be good. I'm gonna be meeting up with some more people, getting some more features in the YouTube channel and get some things that you guys can learn from and just keep on track with what I'm doing for my fitness life. So yeah. Uh, catch you guys later. Who's that over there? Is that Chrissy? Getting the gym stuff going. Got some shirts left. You guys want some shirts? $15. Look at you. Alrighty, so we're gonna start out since someone was taking a really bad dump in the bathroom and stunk up the whole corner of the squat racks and all that. We're gonna start out in the CrossFit area and do some front squats. So here's me starting out. Um, well, I didn't start out with this. I started out with just the 25. And we did, I did five sets, Chris did eight. Um, I was talking with some buddies um, in the gym. And so we didn't want to start out with squat and I wanted to just really do whatever Chris was trying to do so that way I can get back into the groove since it's been seven full days but really eight days with not it. So um, I was pretty satisfied. Here's my heaviest set I was doing and I was doing 10 reps each time. So with these obviously I'm not going to just go heavy and do five to eight reps. There's no point in doing that, especially if you haven't been at the gym in a while. So for me, losing four pounds and being sick, I felt really good. So front squats are a great alternative for if you don't like back squats, which if you can do these, you can definitely do back squats. But um, I recommend doing these. It's It's been like three months for me since I've done them. Um, I'm going to start in um, incorporating front squats in my normal workout. So Chris, uh, this is what he stuck with. He couldn't really go too heavy, the bar, but he, he just couldn't hold the bar right. You have to know how to hold the bar right. Uh, it, it's hard to explain in person. Uh, I hold the bar opposite of what Chris is doing right here. This hurts my wrist really bad. So um, it's, it's just your preference on if you want to do these and how you hold the bar. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna be going to squats after this. Look at this faggot. He feels like throwing up because it's pre-workout. <laughs> oh, watch me hit this but Oh shit. What you still in your workout partner? Hi Jesse Gaines. Hey baby, what's happening? <sighs> Alrighty, so yep, yeah, that that's Chris being Chris. Um, I actually didn't get 315 on here because it for some reason stopped recording. But yeah, we I did since Chris was being a little baby. I did um, five sets of squats and five to six reps each time, going parallel. I like I said, I'm feeling really good. I just didn't want to go super heavy today. So yeah, um, this is me doing squats. I'm gonna move into some leg curls next. Here's leg curls. Um, 
since I'm not feeling well today uh, and going back into the group, my, my workout's not going to be a uh, normal type of workout for me. This is just me getting back into the group and things. So here I did three sets real quick and 15 reps each. Um, with these, you can do them different ways. If you want to build your legs certain ways, go heavy, obviously, if you want to get them stronger. More defined, you want to go 12 to 15 to 20 reps. Um, slow controlled or fast and steady. So um, either way, it's up to you. Um, then these next workouts I'm gonna do after that, three sets of 15. Um, I go into a shoulder workout. Like I said, I want to do shoulders. My shoulders are my weak point. So I'm gonna start doing shoulders twice, three times a week. Um, once I get back into some of the group of things, I'm gonna give myself a week till I make a new plan and workout schedule. I'll let you guys know what my new schedule is gonna be after a week or two getting back into the gym. Um, these are front raises, saw them from Steve Cook. Uh, you squeeze at the top, get a light weight, and just, it's front front delts. You're building the front delts. It's a great way to do them. Just squeeze at the top when you're uh, lifting. Did three sets of those for 15 reps. Um, then I go into, uh, flies, rear delt flies, and with these you can go really heavy, you can go really light, or go in between and get your reps. Right here I was super sitting doing rear delt flies for 10, then I'm going into an Arnold press. It's not exactly an Arnold press, there's like two, three different ways people do them. This is the way I like doing them. So go into that and 10 reps there. And then right after, I'm going into a standing shoulder press. I like standing better than sitting because you get to flex your core, you get to burn, and um, stabilize yourself better than you would by sitting. You're sitting down most of the day, depending on who you are. And this just works a way better way of building your shoulders, and it builds your abs too in the same time. So that was our superset, three sets of those total, so three rounds of that superset. And then going into... Um, I call them empty the milk. Did these in high school. Uh, Coach Schaefer, that's that's what he called them. So I called them emptying out the milk. Uh, and these were your your shoulders and your traps at the same time. So did 10 to 12 reps of these, sticking to a uh, like a medium sized weight. You don't want to go too heavy and flex and squeeze at the top. And then I go into uh, front raises again, but this is overhand grip and doing uh, 10 to 15 reps, depending on how I'm feeling. So super sending with these again, just trying to get that shoulder burn. I love doing super sets with uh, shoulders, so try those out. And then for my last exercise, I go into my um, leg extensions. I did single leg because double leg was taken. Trying to get that teardrop look, get my legs more defined, so do these. Flex at the top, squeeze slow, whatever you want to do. Um, just don't go super heavy and go half or don't even get more than like 8 reps. There's no point. Get 10 to 15 at least um, doing these. So yeah, guys, um, thanks for watching. Uh, that's, that's, that's my workout for today. It's Like I said, it's been a struggle. Ending up school finals was hard and then me being sick. So... Um, this is, I'm going to try and get back to you guys. I, I know a lot of you guys request stuff, so try and get there. I'm trying to get more people to be in my videos, not just me being it. i um, trying to get our Instagram page, The Hummy Fitness. Um, follow us on there. I'm trying to get some more followers. We're getting, we have our shirts left. If you guys want some of those, hit me up, Instagram. And um, we're going to make some hats, I think, next. So, yeah, if you guys have any questions or comments, just write me you guys know what to do so thanks for watching and stay tuned for our upcoming videos